Natsu Samire is someone who at first I didn't like very much. She didn't do anything too special in the ring, and her antics were kind of annoying to me. That all changed around April of this year. After her exploding bat death match, she started actually wrestling a bit, and now all of a sudden her antics and such weren't bothering me. She is a blessing in stardom and one of the best entertainers in it right now. With that said, her outfit is very unflattering for her. The cuts by the hips make her look fat when she clearly isn't, as anyone can attest from the many pictures of her in different outfits and from photo shoots she does. She is by no means fat, but her outfit just doesn't portray that well at all. I think if she got rid of the side cutouts, it would really help her image. Number 9. Looking back, this outfit isn't that bad, so it is much lower on the list. I think my disliking of this outfit stems from the fact that I do not like camo at all. I have always thought that camo is pretty stupid for some reason. So while there isn't technically anything wrong with this outfit, the fact that she has camo pants on kind of ruins the aesthetic of the whole outfit for me. So really not that bad, so it doesn't deserve a higher spot. Number 8. I was originally going to put Hiromi Mamura's biker pants outfit much higher towards the top when going by memory alone. But while making this list, I looked up all the outfits I could remember that I hated, and while I'm still not a fan of this one, it wasn't nearly as bad as I seem to have remembered it as. Maybe the fact that later she gets the coolest outfit in stardom to me made this one look worse in comparison. So while I didn't like this outfit because of the biker pants part, its place on the list does not deserve to be more towards the top than here. Number 7. When I decided the order of this list, it was before watching the show with Saki's revamped new outfit. So the one that makes this list is not the newest one, but the one she wore up until a little bit ago. While looking at this outfit from the top only, it looks pretty good. Very stylish and the accessories and stuff really give it an appealing look. The problem is when you include the bottom half. It's absolutely terrible. It's big and poofy and looks like a diaper. Every time I see this outfit, all I can see is her running around in a large diaper and it completely ruins it for me. It looks like the new outfit got rid of these shorts or at least covered them so you can't see them all the time. So that's a good thing. Number 6. Before Hazuki was spelled HZK, she went by the name Ryo Hazuki. I didn't really see her wrestle too much like this, but from the parts that I have seen, this outfit is pretty dumb. It looks like a cheap jester outfit she found in a closet somewhere and decided it was good enough. I don't like the material this is made out of. It makes it look cheap and not eye-catching. Then the bottoms have those pointy patterns that can only be described as a jester outfit. I don't feel like this outfit was very good, and I'm starting to think her hood outfit was just a fluke because I'm not a big fan of her new outfits either. Number 5. When Momo Watanabe joined Queen's Quest, I wasn't nearly as big a fan of her as I am now. When I started watching Stardom, I started from the first show of 2017 and continued to watch until I caught up with the present day at the time. So I only saw Momo wrestle for about a month before she got injured and was out for the better part of the year. Even if the time I watched her before her injury was short, I still remember how dumb her first Queen's Quest outfit was. It didn't fit her at all in my opinion. It looked like something Jungo Kiona would have worn. It had this jungle Tarzan feel to it, which I feel was really off-putting. Since then, her outfits have been much better, so I'm glad this outfit was short-lived. Number 4. Looking at Kagetsu now, it's hard to believe she ever had a bad outfit. I mean, she seems to have a pretty good understanding of having a simple yet cool-looking outfit. Well, when she first came to stardom, her outfit was terrible. Just some zebra yoga pants and just a regular shirt you could find at any clothing store. I'm not a fan of animal print in general, and then mix that with how cheap and basic the outfit looked, and I feel like it deserves a spot on the list. I am very glad she has gotten much better at picking out outfits. Number 3. As much as I like Jungo Kiona, one of her original outfits is really, really bad to me. I had a hard time deciding between two of her earlier outfits, but I finally chose this one. It just looks really bad to me. Incredibly cheap looking, which makes it unappealing to look at. She didn't look cool in this outfit to me at all, but it looked like a hobo who decided to step in the ring. I'm glad she has gotten some good outfits since then, but this one truly deserves a spot to me. Its cheap look mixed with the jungle theme really kept her from looking like a legit threat. Number 2. 
Shiki Shibusawa's outfit is terrible. Everything about it just looks bad. The small tutu around her waist wouldn't be that much of a problem, but it just doesn't go with the leg warmer she wears. It conflicts so much to me that I can't help but notice how bad it looks every time she's on the screen. Hopefully, she will get a new outfit soon since she has been wrestling for over a year now. With other STARS members all getting new or updated outfits lately, I can only hope that Shiki isn't too far behind in changing it forever. Number 1 Now, my number 1, technically, I can't really say why I hate it so much. I mean, it's not a good outfit by any means, but it's also not a seriously terrible one either. I think it's just a perfect combination of everything I hate mixed into one outfit that pushed it to the top. Or maybe since it's one of the few outfits on this list that still is being used, I could just have a fresher hatred for it. Leo Onozaki's outfit is my pick for the number one worst outfit in stardom. There isn't a single thing I like about it. The flames look tacky and instead of looking cool, bring down her image. The material makes it look extremely cheap, like she is just wearing a big bag over herself. The design of the outfit itself isn't very good in my opinion either, with the one strap type deal. Other people have had designs similar, but for some reason Leo's just looks... not as good. All in all, I really hope that Leo gets an outfit change soon, because I feel like it's doing her no favors at all. I thought Jungle Kiona said that she was going to get new outfits for Ruka and Leo around the time they said they were going to get new outfits for themselves, but it hasn't happened yet, so I don't know if it ever will. 